Welcome to the world of probiotic foods. This is Cultured Food Life with your host, Donna Schwenk. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining me. And today we're going to be talking about the amazing benefits of bifidobacteria. So everybody needs lots of bifido. Now, bifidobacteria is a group of beneficial bacteria that reside primarily, primarily in the intestines. And they play a crucial role in maintaining a healthy gut, overall well-being, and keeping your immune system running really strong. I'm hearing more and more from people um, that they've had diminished bifidobacteria. They've been tested, and some of them don't even have any. There's been a lot of things going on, and people are losing it, uh, losing their bifidobacteria, which is really crucial um, to running your immune system. And if you don't have enough, your immune system struggles, and then you wind up with autoimmune diseases, often get food allergies, histamine problems, and so much more. So it's really, really important that you have a lot of good bifidobacteria. Here are some of the things that bifidobacteria can do. So for your gut health and digestion, bifido is essential for a healthy digestive system. It helps break down the dietary fiber into short-chain fatty acids, which nourish the cell lining um, that line the gut. And this process aids in regular bowel movements, prevents constipation, and it keeps that gut lining sealed off and intact so you don't have things like leaky gut syndrome and um, all kinds of things like IBS. It helps to see, help seal that along with acromantia, which is another bacteria. Those are very crucial to keeping your gut lining intact. But as we age, the composition of our gut microbiome changes and it often leads to a decrease in beneficial bacteria and an increase in harmful ones. And this imbalance can result in gastrointestinal issues and a decline in overall health. The fiddle bacteria helps restore this balance by enhancing those populations of good bacteria in the gut. This helps your immune system. Um, it helps the restoration for better digestion, nutrient absorption, and a strong immune response, all of which are really crucial for healthy aging. So a significant portion of the immune system is located in the gut, and bifido plays a huge role in helping to regulate that immune refunction. These beneficial bacteria help to re uh, regulate the immune responses by enhancing the body's ability to fight off infections and illness. They stimulate the production of antibodies and other immune cells providing a robust defense against pathogens. So if you don't have enough beneficial bacteria in your gut, especially bifido, you can't make the antibodies that fight pathogens and infections. So the more bifido you have and the more healthy bacteria you have overall, the more of those special helpers we will have available to you, which are going to keep you healthy and help you to fight off foreign invaders in your gut or pathogens and to keep you things running really strong. Now, chronic inflammation is a significant contributor to the aging process and age-related diseases. Bifidobacteria has anti-inflammatory properties that help modulate the immune system and reduce that systemic inflammation. It lowers inflammation and can migrate the risk of conditions like cardiovascular disease, arthritis, and other inflammatory disorders, thus promoting a very healthy, longer life. Because inflammation is at the heart of um, things like heart disease, and it causes um, all kinds of things to go haywire in the body. You want inflammation to go down, and Bifidol is very good at that. Okay, now Bifidol also helps with your health and your mood. It has uh, Bifidol also may have neuroprotective effects. Research suggests that these probiotics can support brain health by induce, influencing the gut-brain axis. Bifido has many species and strains in it, and one of those is Bifido longdom, which has long been found to upregulate the expression of dopaminergic neurons, potentially offering protective effects and benefits against neurodegenerative diseases like Parkinson's disease, and this can help you maintain cognitive function and mental clarity as you age and get older. Now, another great thing about Bifido is it helps with weight management. Um, it helps to regulate the metabolism 
and the absorption of nutrients contributing to a healthy weight. Bifido is the first bacteria you get when you're born. And it's, they call it the young bacteria. It's what keeps you young. You ever seen young people can eat whatever they want and stay thin? It's because they have a lot, a lot of bifido bacteria. So as you get older, it can diminish if you don't feed it and take care of it. So by improving your gut health and having more bifido bacteria, you can reduce the risk of obesity, regulate metabolic disorders, and some studies suggest that beneficial bacteria can inf- influence the release of hormones that control appetite and fat storage. And I've actually seen that happen to me. The more bifido I had, um, the more balanced I felt about how much I ate, how much I didn't. Um, I know that it's one of those really important ones in my diet that do help me to feel younger. Now, skin health is another great thing that Bifido does. It's very supported by Bifido bacteria. A lot of a lot of uh, facial products now are coming out with Bifido in it. Um, but these bacteria can help reduce inflammation and promote the production of healthy skin cells. Because I think you should get it from the skin is a reflection of getting the foods you eat from the inside out. Um, your skin will look better when you have a healthy microbiome, and Bifido is a big part of that. A healthy gut always leads to clearer skin and helps you manage conditions like acne, eczema, rosacea. Um, That's a very important part of your gut health and your skin health. And it reflects, it shows in your skin when you have a good, healthy microbiome. Now, uh, Bifido also has been indicated that it can help improve bone health by enhancing calcium absorption and reducing bone loss. This is particularly beneficial for older adults who are at a higher risk of osteoporosis and fractures. By supporting bone density and strength, Bifido contributes to overall physical health and mobility, which is crucial for a longer active life. And um, I have seen this, you know, as people get older and they lose these crucial bacteria or they diminish, um, they start to have problems all over throughout the whole body with inflammation, with bone problems. They're not absorbing the nutrients they need because without the right bacteria, you can't absorb the nutrients in the food that you eat. And Bifido is a big one. Now, how you get more Bifido bacteria? One of the best ways to do that is with HMOs, which are human milk oleosaccharides. They're specific prebiotic carbohydrates and essentially super prebiotics occurring naturally in mother's milk. Now, you can get HMOs um, that ha- that help to increase bifido bacteria. And no, you're not drinking human milk, but rather a prebiotic that's specifically made by the process of fermentation that creates more bifido bacteria. They even put this in baby formulas now because having bifido is the first bacteria you get from your mother. And it's the one of the most important. It just, it sets up the whole immune system in the child. And so it's so crucial that even baby, they're putting in baby formulas so that uh, the HMOs to give the babies a, you know, a great start to having a healthy immune system. So there's a product they call HMOs. I sell it and you can see them other places too. And it's just a powder and you just put it, I like to put it in my smoothie or you can put it in water. And these HMOs help improve the immune system by stimulating innate immune system responses. They inhibit pathogens like E. coli. They reduce inflammation. And bifidolongtum is a subspecies. uh, And bifidolongtum subspecies um, is also, they've got B. bifido impetus, which also boosts the production of proteins that close the gap between gut cells to keep microbes out of of the bloodstream and increase anti-inflammatory molecules that boost the immune system. Um, to achieve these beneficial results, B. impetus has to feed on HMOs, and that's why this is such a great product. I think of all the things you can do to increase your Bifido, HMOs is the best. It works the best, and you don't have to take it forever. It just increases it fourfold within a few, like within a week or two weeks. It really works very, very well. Now, another thing you can do, we have a yogurt called Yogurt Plus that has Bifido, There's a lot of yogurts at grocery store that have bifidobacteria, and I use my Yogurt Plus all the time. I put it in everything from salad dressings to dips. I make, oh my gosh, what did I make the other day? I used, I made a Greek 
I made a Greek salad and I made it a dressing with it and it was creamy and delicious. And, um, I also have done this to make some tzatziki dip with yogurt plus that worked really good. I put feta cheese in it, some olive oil and some seasonings. And wow, is it good? It just is. There's all different kinds of way you can use yogurt plus. And it's just a really standard yogurt that has a lot of good strains in it and has a lot of buffeto in it. Um, and so we sell that, but you can also get other uh, yogurts in the store that have buffeto that are equally beneficial and really good. Homemade is always, you're going to get more buffeto if you make it yourself. And it only takes like six or seven hours to make. And it works very, very well. And um, it's easy, so you can have it within less than a day. And I love making it because it's super easy. And one of the things about um, this yogurt is you can make it with all different kinds of milk. You can do it with um, homemade cashew milk. I have a coconut cashew one that's really good. Um, so you can do non-dairy. But they all work. I've got a whole bunch of them on my website, and I'll put that in this article in the description. So when you click on it, you can go see all the recipes I have. Now, another product we have is keep called Kefir Soda, which is a wonderful bubbly Kefir Soda drink that has very little sugar and it has bifido in it too, and some good yeasts that are very beneficial to probiotic in nature. It contains all kinds of beneficial yeast and bacteria that make this soda super bubbly and a great healthy replacement for soda if you like that kind of carbonation. Each package will make you dozens and dozens and dozens of kefir soda if you make it often enough. So you can use the portion of one bottle to make another bottle, use that bottle, make another bottle, and it just keeps going as long as you keep doing it. The strains and yeast metabolize the natural sugar found in the juice you use or the coconut water resulting in a really effervescent drink that is loaded with probiotics and it's super fun to make. And it eats most of the sugar. I think within uh, a few days, 85% of all the sugars are gone. And then if you if you let it, put it in the fridge. Because you want to be careful when you make this soda because it can get very bubbly and explode if you don't. But once you put it in the fridge, it continues to slowly ferment in there. And you'll taste it. The sugars will be gone. The sweetness will be gone. But it will leave you this bubbly effervescent drink similar to kombucha but with different strains of bacteria in it um, and specifically bifido because kombucha doesn't have that but this one um, is a great way to get some more bifido in your diet and really enjoy having that bubbly drink so those are a few of the different ways I'm just I'm just trying to get everybody to increase their bifido because I see so many people struggling with autoimmune immune diseases and specific symptoms where they're all of a sudden having food allergies and building up a fiddle will help eliminate all that. Um, often food allergies are caused by missing strains of bacteria and a is a big one. If you really struggle with dairy, I can imagine that your bifido is very diminished because that's, bifido loves lactose. So it eats up all the lactose and helps your body to digest it and absorb it. So if you really st struggle with that, I would really suggest that you start building up your bifido bacteria because that's something that it does very, very well. It helps prevent food allergies too. Um, it helps to restore your body back to normal so you don't have food allergies. And I've seen that again and again. And um, it does it quite effectively and actually does it pretty fast. So a lot of people have been having more food allergies. And if you do, that's a sign that you're missing strains of good bacteria in your gut and you need to restore that. And it's easy to do, and it works much better with food than it does probiotics. Probiotics can be very hard on the body because they can take these huge quantities of these species of bacteria, and they have all different ones combined in one capsule. And then they go to parts of the body where they don't belong, they open up, and they shouldn't be there, like in the small intestine area. And then you got SIBO, and you got all kinds of problems. Well, cultured foods that are in the form of food, don't do that. They speed to the parts of the body where they belong because they have food as a transport. And then you're not having all these different kinds of problems that can happen if you take different strains and large amounts of probiotic supplements, which I've seen an increase of people having SIBO and things like that, which I think can be due to people taking too many and then opening up in the wrong place. 
So I hope that helps you. I hope that you'll have more bifido in your diet. Um, start looking for it. Um, you'll see it on the back of yogurts at stores and things, and you'll especially make your own or take some HMOs. And it, you don't have to take it forever. Um, it works very fast. It's very effective. And um, it's always going to make you feel better to have more bifido in your body. So I hope that helps. And we will talk to you next time.